Good morning everyone. I'm Dr. Shruti Bajaj, Director and Consultant Clinical Geneticist at the Purple Gene Clinic Mumbai. I'm often asked what does a clinical geneticist exactly do? Well, clinical geneticists are experts dealing in genetic and rare diseases. These are very varied disorders and there's really no age limit to their presentation. So these diseases can first present when the child is in the womb to even as late as the 6th decade of life. Some examples of genetic disorders include down syndrome, thalassemia, spinal muscular atrophy, duchenne muscular dystrophy, cystic fibrosis, to name a few. So when a patient with a suspected genetic disorder presents for the first time to the geneticist, he undergoes a clinical evaluation. In this clinical evaluation, we take a detailed analysis of the patient's complaints, try and understand the onset, nature, duration, progress of the complaints. We take a detailed family history, examine the patient, have a look at his old reports and at the end of it, arrive at a logical conclusion, at a differential diagnosis, which may be an explanation about the patient's uh, symptoms. If this diagnosis requires a genetic test, uh, we then counsel the patient about the same through a pre-test genetic counseling session. As the name suggests, in the pre-test session, the patient understands what is the genetic test that is being chosen, what is the cost, where are we sending it, what are the chances of us picking up the disorder, what are the chances that we may get some uncertain, unwanted secondary findings, and so on. These relevant aspects are discussed with the patient in the pre-test genetic counselling session. If the patient indeed uh, decides to go ahead for the test, uh, this is usually done by drawing around 2 to 4 ml of blood and the sample is then sent to the genetic laboratory. The results come back to us anywhere ranging from 10 days to around 50 to 60 days depending on the test that we have chosen. Now, what does the report exactly say? This is explained to the patient in the post-test genetic counselling session. In this session, we explain to the patient the correctness of the report. Has it helped us to solve the dilemma? Has it helped us to diagnose the condition? Or do we need further test? It also helps us to explain to the patient what is the likely diagnosis. Many a times, these confirmed diagnoses help us to predict the nature of the disease, help us to uh, understand what could be the likely complications that may be associated with the disease, sometimes even minimize or prevent these complications. Uh, if the disease is treatable and has got a definitive cure or a therapy, the patient is then guided towards the same. Often, even if definitive therapy is not available, the patient can be provided supportive care. Last but not the least, getting to know about the diagnosis can also help us to explain to the patient what is the risk of the other family members getting the same genetic disease. If it's a couple who has a young child with genetic disease, they can be made to understand what are the options through which they can prevent their next baby to get the same disease. So well, yes, this is what a geneticist does. Um, at the Purple Gene Clinic, we offer genetic services not just to the walk-in patients but also through teleconsultation and uh, we are in fact pleased to share that we also have a special OPD that's called as a Shanti Devi Gupta Charitable OPD which uh, tries to cater to the economically weaker section of the society. Uh, detailing about what all we do can be quite a lot to say. You can get all the aspects of the genetic services offered at our center on our web page that's www.geneticsinindia.com thank you so much